Hello everyone and welcome again to our channel. In today's video, we will study the alpha beta pruning algorithm. Actually, alpha beta pruning algorithm is also called the advanced version of minimax algorithm. And those of you who didn't study or who don't know what we mean by minimax algorithm, I recommend them to watch our last video where we have explained in detail the minimax algorithm, what does it mean and how it can be implemented. Actually, this minimal max algorithm is mostly used for game playing. Well, game playing means that uh, to create such program that can compete in different games against human. Uh, games where logic is involved, such as tic tac toc or chess. And uh, as we know that one of the main goal of artificial intelligence is to create machines that can perform human work. And one of them is to play game against human. In minimax algorithm, the time complexity is order of b power d, where b is the branching factor. It means that at each node, we have b number of branches, and this is the depth of tree. It means the levels, different levels that we have in a tree. Alpha beta pruning is actually used to reduce this time complexity and to improve the efficiency of our program. Alpha beta pruning works on the mechanism of depth first search. Here we see a diagram and now I will explain you what different terms here mean. Next, then we have mean, then next and then mean. In max and mean algorithm, actually uh, we consider that we have two different players. One we name has max, another one has min. Both are playing against each other, just like it happened in case of tic tac talk or just playing. Max is the person or a player that want to maximize his reward, which means at the end of the game he want to get the maximum reward. Whereas min is his opponent, he want to reduce the reward of max. So this is what do we mean by max and min. And here down there you see at the end we have terminal nodes and also we have utilities. And utilities are actually they are the award, the score, the reward that can be get at the end of a game. So here we don't have just two values win and loss but we have points or we have rewards which is values in the form of numerical values. 3, 4, 2, 1. So this is a, that is what a player can get by the end of the game. Here we have different nodes. I have written under node the name of them A, B, then we have C, D, E, F, then H, I, J, K, L, M, and O. Well, generally we used alpha to represent the value of max, whereas beta is used to represent the value of min. So that is why I have written alpha against max and beta against min and has it used to be in different games that firstly one player take turn here max then second in this case min then again first max and then then min so we see that last term last term was min term before the end of game as I mentioned earlier that in case of alpha beta pruning we use the first search mechanism. So that means that we move towards the last node, leftmost node. Here in this case we have that one, H, our last node. So first of all we are going to explore this node and its values. Here we have min. I have already explained you that uh, min want to minimize the reward or utility of max. And at this position, H min will play. So here, there are two different values, two different utilities that can be chosen. As I mentioned earlier, that we are going to start with the left one. So it means when we explore this utility, the value of beta will come as 3. On left mode, this is 3 value. That's why the value of beta is 3. What will be value of min here? Min value can be less than or equal to 3. 
Why? Because here are from here are the made min cancel it and can see that beta is 3. So he took 3 value, but still he try to get even lesser value because he always want the to minimize the reward. But here you see that uh, he, when he explore the right hand side of this node, the utility, the value is 4. So it means value of B will still stay 3. And min will also have the value 3. Or we usually say that now the value of min is fixed as 3 because both the nodes have been explored. Once the value is fixed, it is moved upward at higher order node. From here it will move to alpha. So now this at node D, the value of alpha will be 3. But at node D, the max is playing. And uh, as I discussed earlier, that max always want to get the maximum reward. So value of max will be here greater than or equal to 3. We always see the value of min in descending order. Want to get the minimum value. Whereas in case of maximum, max we take the ascending order. We try to look for maximum value. So here max can see that he want greater than or equal to 3 because 3 RD he gets from this left hand side of this node D. Now going to search the other side which means node I. So and but here still there is a term of min. On this level, the last level, min is playing here, there, there. It means that min can be at this position, min can be at that position, that or this one, and this way continue. In case of uh, max, the max can plan for maximum utility. He want to achieve maximum, but he cannot predict the move of his opponent min, who want to minimize the reward. Min can be on this level after when max will play like this, if, if, if max choose this one, if max choose this one, maybe then min can be at this level. So we have to see the values at all different levels. So at, uh, at, at different nodes. So here at node i, the value of beta will be 2 when it search for left hand side. Explore left hand side 2. So what will be value of meaning here? As I mentioned earlier, it can be less than or equal to 2. Why? Because he also try to get even the lesser value. Or he here when uh, the beta get the value of 2, two min will get the value less than or equal to 2 because min always try to get the minimum value. But for now, value of min is 2. Whereas here this beta get the value 2. Here when beta gets its first value, it is true, 2. Uh, Max observed that for the, now, for the time being he has value 3. But he want a value greater than 3. But he see that after just exploring left hand side, the value become 2. Beta value become 2. And min is trying to even get the lesser value. So already Max know that he will not get a value greater than 3. So he will not going to explore or search this one, this branch. It's already not required because min wants the less one, but already Max observed that from exploring the left hand side of node i, the value of beta is 2. So no need to now explore the right hand side because anyhow it's main term and he will look for smaller one. So for max now 3 is fine. So here now the value of max is fixed here 3. And I, as I mentioned before that once the value is fixed, it is passed up to higher level. So it will move up there to beta. And now the value of beta at node B will become 3. But here you say is, here is the turn of min. And min for that time being he has value 3. But he is, will try to look for even smaller value. Because as I said earlier that min wants to minimize the utility of max. So after left hand side now B will search the right hand side of 3. There we have E, but firstly we will go down there, as I mentioned earlier, we will follow the depth search mechanism. 
so we will go to this move from E then we will from there we move to, to move, move to node J and J here also we have the term of mean and in case mean is at this node at node J where he has two different terms to make or he can get two different utilities firstly he will explore the left hand side that is 7 so uh, beta value becomes 7 here but mean also still want to look for something smaller than 7 so value of mean can be less than or equal to 7 many of you can be less than or equal to 7 here uh, now when it look at the right hand side that is it will become 8 so mean will see that that is higher so it will choose the same the value 7 and it will also stay, stay still 7 so here also the value of mean is fixed as 7 it is now moved upward to higher level and the value of alpha at node e will become 7 here it will become 7 and uh, now it is the term of max so max value will also become 7 but he will try to look for even higher value than 7 so like 7 but here upper level at b mean already has value 3 and when he say on c on the right hand side he said that max already is trying to get value greater than 7 so here minimum value will be 7 for max but it can be more than 7 but b, mean already observe that the minimum value is 7 and now from right hand side he is getting 3 so he will not going to explore the other part he will prune out this right hand side of node D and based on just this value 7 of alpha he will make decision and will choose the move from where it can get value 3 so here now the value of min is fixed at 3 and as I mentioned earlier that once the value is fixed it will move up to higher level and in this case that it will be the last level that is alpha so now here alpha value is 3 but max wants something even greater than 3 so for now max also value become 3 but he will try to look for something even higher at node a so now it will he will search max will search for values on right hand side so then maybe he will get some higher reward so as mentioned before left through search so move from a to c and then f and then l here it was min term term of min on same level all terms will become min term so at, at this l not l min will first, first of all look for smaller value or left hand side value that is 2 so become 2 it will look for something smaller on right hand side but it's 11 so it will stay value 2 will become fixed value will become fixed as 2 so at node f it will give value to alpha as 2 but here as i mentioned before that max level is the level of max so max will try to get something greater than or equal to 2 from here so it will look at right hand side and from here first of all it mean turn so um, mean will choose from left hand side one beta value will become also here one because firstly we explore left hand side one and when beta value become one and max will see that now he has two and he wants something more than two but from here is coming one value so he will not going to again search this part right hand side and will choose two as his value so now he at this level at node f the max value is fixed as two so once value is fixed now it will move up to higher level so it give value to mean or to beta beta will get value two here we have mean mean also get value 2 but will try to get something smaller than 2 so mean will uh, uh, look on right hand side we find it but at this position also at higher level we have max max already has value 3 you will see down there he said that mean already got 2 value 
and he is looking for something even smaller so max will not be interested to search for this particular path so these branches will be pruned out also and based on this value of 2 max will decide to fix the value as 3 this way how we prune out different paths which are not required to explore during the game and we can reduce the complexity of our program in general it is said that alpha beta pruning has a complexity of other of b d divided by 2 so in average on average or in best case the complexity of alpha beta pruning is b order of b power d by 2 but this is best case or average case in worst case it will be same like minimax algorithm i hope that uh, you learned something new from today's lecture please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like this video thank you